the Lucian play style at the moment is like it's uh I don't know the DPS play style is kind of like dead at the moment. Mm -hmm. Probably might go alive again in season four. I don't know, like depending on what patch notes we get and stuff. But um, I I found that like you know obviously helping your team is good, but like I said, you know your worst enemy is always your tank. You know your own teammates half the time. <laughs> That's hundred percent true. Never... Yeah. Um, what do you think you're struggling with right now? Yeah, honestly, the I like kind of like what the best value play is. So I think like. Oh, so yeah. So I'll summarize like my experience so far. So we started like, uh, I think this account started in gold and it was like, first it was like, nobody was saying anything and we were, we were fine. We're winning. And then I got to like plat and everyone like on earth hated Lucio. They were just like, fuck off, switch off Lucio, calling me the N word, like trolling the game actively, like, just <coughs> not, not happy that I was playing Lucio. Then I muted all voice chat. We're now in like diamond two and yeah. I'm like, yeah, go ahead. Uh, I, I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if just staying out of voice and, like, as you get to, like, what, Masters Plus would just be the play. But then again, when you get to top 500, most people are never in voice anyway, so, you know. The cycle. The cycle yeah. of voice. <laughs> like, uh, I mean, I've, I've always heard it a lot, like, but I have another account, right, that I, I was playing, like, I used for, like, off-stream, but I played on stream recently. It's very obvious it was me, right? It was straight up, you know, Hatsune Miku. It's like, yeah, who, who's going to be the Lucio player with that name? You know what I mean? I'm still getting flamed by a bunch of people. And, like, there's a big difference because it's like, like, am I, do I only get flamed, like, because I'm not, like, seen as a streamer here or, like, what? Mm. All that sort of stuff. So it's like, people, people will focus on, like, you a lot more. I think Lucio is just, like, a, always generally, like, a, a gamble pick to a lot of players. You have to, you have to really show up. If you want to, like, you know, for your teammates to actually go, like, oh, yeah, wait, this guy's actually doing wonders. But most of the time, even if you're doing a lot, you're still going to get flamed. It's shit. Because he stats really badly, right? Like, if you're doing good stuff, his stats are just really bad. Uh, it depends. But most of the, like, okay, so when I've gone up against Overwatch League Lucios, these guys are 10 times better than me. It's absolutely insane. These guys are racking up the best stats I've ever seen in, like, oh, Lucio, yeah. like, ever. Like, uh, man. Funny Astro, uh, or like OG, for example, those are the two Lucio players I encounter on ladder. Like, uh, and they, like, it's like 10 minutes in the game. These guys got like 8k damage on Lucio. I'm like, what are they doing? Do they have like yeah, yeah, damage yeah. boost or something like that? I don't get it. And I'm like sitting on like 4k and I'm like, how, like, I don't get it. I, I was like, you know. But I think right now, with the ult charge buff, like, they gave him like what, an extra 7% or something like that to build ult faster. Like, right now, like, the best playstyle to actually climb without going hardcore DPS is literally just building beat all the time because it's so it can be so valuable. And also, like, oh, I hate to be rude, like dumb players will see beat and actually want to fight instead of just sitting mm. and choke twenty four seven. Not trying to be rude <laughs> to like low rank players, but like they hear like you know let's break it down. And they're like, oh yeah, let's go, let's fight, you know, all that sort of stuff. Yeah, cause cause the big struggle I've been finding is like, I mean, I'm not calming because like the minute I calm, I I want to I want to like try and uh, uh, replicate the authentic experience, and like this is again this there's no like non dickish way of saying this, but the like 50 percent chance I calm the like, SVB, and then it's like you know people are it, it's like it's different <laughs> then right, so well, like I found the oh sorry, no no I was just gonna say so I'm like trying to like engage with my team, but like nobody knows what amp speed does basically. Uh, well, what I did, uh, for a bit, and I'm not sure if it really does make an impact, I had, like, some of my number keys just binded to, like, uh, in-game voice lines to, like, oh, you know, like I'm literally, I'm literally like, three, just spamming two, the one. voice line, like, yeah, yeah, I'm usually just spamming the voice line, let's push forward, let's push forward, like, every time I amp, and, you know, I don't know if people actually listen or not, but, like, you know, it might work, might not work, so, but I, I generally use, like, voice comms like uh from the character itself or that's like the com wheel and stuff and, and it, it might help i'm not fully sure and it might just sound like i'm being an absolute asshole because i'm just spamming it up my tank for like for like a good minute just being like can you please walk in yeah 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 that, so that's been like you know I'll, what i'd love for you to do is like just you know i'll I'll queue up i've shared the screen with you and like tell me in game like what what do you think i should be doing differently and stuff but yeah i kind of would love to like love the bigger picture thing where it's just like yeah my biggest struggle is just like because I feel like Lucio's value, and again, correct me if I'm wrong, maybe I have misunderstandings about Lucio, but, like, I feel like, obviously, the value is the speed engages and, like, pulling your team together into, like, an out, but in and out, right? Like, you, you put people in when you want to go, you speed them out. Like, they yeah. ult, you speed them out. Or, like, but but what I'm, what's happening is, like, I don't know if you caught 
the attack where it's like they nano Ryan. Um, I'm speeding my Ryan back, and he just yolos into the back line and, and slams and dies. <laughs> no, I did see that. I I always choked on my um on my breakfast when I was watching that. I was just laughing my ass off at that Ryan. Oh, it was so bad. No, that's like th that's why I do have like fallback and just go. The only two things that are like bind to those voice lines because it's like, well, I called it. If they didn't listen, well, that's not on me. Okay, cool. Um, before then we go in, like, do you think there's like uh anything like? So you already kind of alluded to the fact that you think kind of heal botting and building B is is the best play style. But do you think there's any like misconceptions about Lucio at the moment? Like going for high damage is super worth it. You know what I mean? Like it, just playing with the team. Obviously in lower ranks, that's where it's more value, but you can play more aggressive as you get to high ranks because people can follow up with you. The other thing I've done recently, and I've tried to incorporate it in rank games and it's, it's been kind of okay, is depending on your other support is, and if it's, you know, Kiriko is probably the best hero uh, that you can do your thing. You're better off just not playing with your team and just playing with like your flanker instead. So in some cases you have a tracer, right? You might as well kind of just stick with her to like give her a little bit of a pocket here and there. Cause a lot of people say like, you know, save your team more or that sort of stuff. But like you flank with tracer, you can get like a lot of value. I kind of wish it was like Genji in there, but like no one wants to play Genji because Genji Lucio dive is incredibly busted in solo queue. The main thing that, like, if you have an Ana, then uh, you, you're not gonna have much luck. You can't really abandon them, especially in the lower ranks, because, I mean, they, they're gonna struggle to hit sleeves. They're gonna, like, <laughs> you know, they're not really gonna have a good time. All right, so yeah, just like, go ahead and like, you know, be as, yell at me as much as you want. Like, be like, all right, SUV, you should do this right now. You should do that right now. And, you know, we'll just play it by ear. Well, you have uh, Ana, right? So that mm -hmm. obviously, it, it depends. If they're not running flankers, you can probably just abandon your Ana. Like, you know, just don't care about her at all. Do you think she might get annoyed? But like, you have Tracer, Do uh, Tracer Doom, right? You can uh, just run around with them, being way more aggressive. It really does depend. If they're running like, you know, Cass or any sort of like people that can instantly shut you down or like some dumb combo, then, you know. I think it's just worth, like, since speed won't really get that much value with like a Doom Piss, does that make sense? Because, uh, yeah, yeah. You know, it's not, it's not like Reinhardt. So like it's better off just guys. following up oh, okay. and like saving your amp for like when it gets low. So I was gonna go push with my DPS, but then I saw these guys getting kind of, and I saw that they have Tracer Sombra, so I was like, I, don't, I probably wanna help my Ana out. <laughs> that Doom is not gonna be happy. <laughs> Oh, nice. Might have my tracer here. She's Wait, yeah, if you, you right just assist side. your tracer, like, you know, that stuff does wonders. I know, I know the positioning because I fucking probably taught this guy this positioning. <laughs> okay, well, yeah, I was very, Could, couldn't I was get very in, curious of what's going on here. Is it worked out, kind of. Oh, he's dead. Shit. Somewhere's here, trying to avoid that. Oh, I'm dead. Okay, any anything you would do um, vastly different there? I think mean, playing with the Tracer is fine. I just, like, don't think it would be super worth it going for the Sombra unless, like, you know your team is going to be fine, you know? Like, if you're, okay. you're going to run a Translocator, you have to be way quicker than that, you know? Okay, okay, okay. Gotcha. But more so, it's usually a drop for Tracer, but that's high ground, so yeah, it does work out for you way more. Um... But since they have Sombra, if you want to do something that's just incredibly unfun, you can just spy check for Sombra the entire game. Either you can hunt her down like an absolute freak, or you can literally <laughs> just like spy I mean, check her like nonstop. Like if you figure out where her translocator is mainly going to be, you can just spy oh check the area God, she's no. going to. Yeah, right. Okay. That's fine. I, got, I was like, these guys are in a choke, let's go, but nah, didn't pan out. I threw. Yeah, you're more than likely you're not going to have like the. You know, your team will not have a good experience playing against Sombra, and like, if you can make your job to just not let her actually, like, get value out of hack, you don't need to kill her, you just need to annoy her. Just it's the same thing with like, Wandering Tracer. Like, you know, they have two flankers, which is an absolute nightmare to deal with, especially for uh, anyone on your team. Oh, he's in. I may need to beat this, but they're gonna EMP in a second, probably. Is he just what? What is he doing? What is he cooking? <laughs> okay, uh, when it comes to beating right, and especially if they have EMP, the best way to like you could can beat EMP now, right? I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. Is just beat behind cover, and, and then and then run around as you the hit cover. the ground. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Just because you know you have that line of sight grace period thing, and that's the most safest way to do it against Sombra. And as long as she's not behind you, like if you see her out there, you know, you'll be fine. But I'm pretty sure you can just like beat around a corner. Like right now, you know. 
Oh, I didn't get it to my sig. I, I turned on the speed, uh, sl well, heal instead of speed for some reason. Like my brain farted. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> you started walking towards him. Yeah, I was like, but it works out. It works out. It was fine. That's well, my animation cancel yeah. a lot as well with my reload. I noticed. I mean, uh, the Sombra's chilling up top, so you can just like continuously poke her out. But she probably doesn't have translocator, so you can might be able to fight her. Huge. Ah, Susie. Well, we got her. We got her. Yeah. No I'm balls. I tried to push him <laughs> off. I tried to push him off. No, that's pretty. It's fine. That's good. I mean, it works out. You got the translocator, and it's pretty much because of that summer dies. There's a uh, play that pretty well. Oh, I thought that was. Oh, my brain was like, that's their <laughs> flux. Oh, that, that's their I was flux. Getting, oh, no. No, I saw it too. I was like, I, I, I thought you were going to beat a little bit earlier after you got hacked. Because you can safely beat after you get hacked. You know, you can't get That's true. Yeah, you can't get hacked again. Yeah. yeah. But, um. Yeah, your team only used like, like 20 ults. It's yeah, they not did. the end of the world. It was though, like a brain you got, check, you got checkpoint. It doesn't really matter. It's not the worst. Oh, mama. <laughs> nice! What the hell? Oh, she's still in, she's still in. Oh, Why do you have good aim with this character? I feel like I <laughs> missed half my- 90% of my shots. No! It's way more consistent than me, I feel like. Well, you get out of these. You get out of these. Nice. Don't I mean, you might as well just- This is gonna be a long fight. You might as well just try to build beat. Okay, okay. That makes sense. I'm gonna go for that. There's no point trying to like oh. go for a 1v1, just you know. Okay, just AFK with the team, is that it? Yeah, yeah. Oh nice. You did it. And then you know, it's just that easy. Okay, so I'll tell you right, that whole like warning stuff, that's part of you it's like, you know, you know, you can easily fix that. But at the same time, it's uh it's just it's just a map diff. It's just map design diff. I'm sorry. I'm not bit, I'm not trying no, to make I've been, the devs. No, I've like, been experiencing this. I'm like, especially all the new maps, they're just like absolutely, there's like random dumb pointless shit everywhere to stop you from wall riding. Yeah. Yeah, I was like, I, I think I joined in your stream, you were playing Circuit Rail, and I'm like, it's probably a good thing this guy's only staying on the floor like 90% of the time. <laughs> if, this guy, if this guy goes on the walls, he will actually have a breakdown on stream. It will, it will drive you insane. With that sort of stuff, you have to do like a... Like an out, oh, how do you explain? It? Like an outwards curve, right? You know. Uh, so in most cases, you got to look up, and then you have to like curve your mouse outwards to like drift around the corner. Basically, does that make sense? Yeah, it's, yeah. So like you're like going like like a little yeah, you're like hooking around the corner or whatever, and then like over it's the a, edge. It's a lot of effort. It's it's terrible. It's just. <laughs> okay, Mercy Lucio. Do you have like a special strategy for Mercy Lucio? Mercy Lucio is fine. People are just like you know like Lucio's end is worse. Like, uh, yeah, the utility is pretty shit because people are gonna be like you won't be able to damage with all that sort of stuff. But if you have a tank who's beefy, you'll be fine. Like a ball. I mean, Rodog used to be the thing. Like Lucio Mercy was good when Rodog was uh, like hardcore meta, just one shotting people. But now it's a little bit more risky. You can uh, push basically here? push six like past his shield because no one's helping. You know, no one's helping you. What's going on? Where's your team? Just, they're honoring the 1v1. <laughs> I think I saved this guy. Nice. That's huge. Yeah, you fight these. You and these. Nice. No. Now yeah, you run. I tried. It's okay. Oh, no. Oh. He dashed in. Oh, <laughs> bro. <laughs> she just straight up yoloed himself into that. And Liana just kind of just 80s spam the top of the 12. Oh my god. Oh, we're actually winning though. Oh, I'm about to get Magno Bang. No, he doesn't All have right. it. He yes! That's huge. Yeah, you can you can win fights with Cass because he has such a good hitbox. He has such a big, juicy hitbox. Oh, you win these. You take these. Oh, here we go. That's okay. Are these cleansed? That's huge. You can get out. Yeah, you can just leave. Never mind. Oh, balls. Oh. Can okay. you make that jump? With say, the... Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, you, you need a you need to look up when you like uh, oh, okay. do like big jumps because you get more height when you do like a 
you know. So like if you're looking down as well, you get kind of like the least amount of height. And it's good for like areas uh, like here where it's like these really yeah, closed in doors. Nice. Yeah, in this case, it's just good to keep uh, your SIG off. Uh, I mean, your fuck. Their SIG off your SIG. That's huge. I don't even need to tell you what to do. You just know exactly what to do. But yeah, you know, beating you just run at someone, yeah? It's per especially if, like, uh, you know, that damage isn't going to be, like, enough. You know, if it's just, like, Cat's Ana, yeah, you can run in. You can do what you want. Yeah, yeah, that's what I've been feeling like, cause you know it's like so much extra HP, and often I find people burn their cooldown on your beat as well. Like, he'll like yeah, magno yeah, yeah. bang my beat, right? And it's like, well, thanks yeah, for that. Yeah, cause if uh, and like you know, like I was saying before, Casa is such a really good forgiving hitbox that after he uses his grenade, you can probably win the match up. The only yeah. thing holding it back is the extra twenty five health. I'm gonna get. But uh, someone, someone's. That's large. That's huge. Yeah, in this case, just keep the sick off your team. And just keep him, like, behind your shield. Nice. Jesus Christ, she to... <laughs> I know, she, like, grouped him somehow. I'm like, what? <laughs> I'm like, who's it? who did this? Oh my god. Yeah, so, um, I think against, I think Sig is like a really good matchup for Lucio because, especially if it's Sig versus Sig, I, I don't know, I think a lot of people sleep on it, right? Um, that you can just keep pushing the Sig into your team, uh, mm -hmm. past his own shield, so he has to drop it, like, most of the time. Like, once that shield's out, you know, he's gonna have to drop it, he's gonna, like, one second cooldown or something like that on it. Yeah. You can move him past the shield, into your shield, right? So then he's cut off from healing, but then he has to just... Disengage. Then he has to shift, grasp to run away. Yeah. Yeah. But like once he's shifting, you know, you can still damage him with boop and melee. That's why I'm like, this is like the best matchup for Lucio in terms of like tanks, I think. Like he, you know, he, he poses no threats except for the rock and uh, one shot combo. Anything like, yeah, anything different to bear in mind or like anything you're, apart from like look up, because I feel like the look up to jump is something I'm not doing enough. Honestly, I think your gameplay will get better over time once your warning improves. Like, I think the one thing that, like, you know, you have the game sense, you know, all that sort of stuff. Like, uh, Lucio is very much just game sense orientated most of the time. Mm -hmm. But then, like, the other thing is just having good movement and knowing how to warrant correctly. Because then if, you know, if your warning sucks, then, you know, you might as well just play a different support. As well. <laughs> yeah. Do I go for Willow here? Do I int on her? From a crazy uh, angle? I have a Mercy Pocket. So you can kind of harass him and just kind of annoy him. Like you can just poke her out, you know? Like don't be afraid to peek him and just, uh, you can like jiggle peek, just go in and out and then AD spam in front of him. Would have players, you know, not really that smart. They're already dead, but um, yeah, yeah they do have a Mercy. So you can, you, can, you, can, you can just play to like stop res constantly. Got you. Okay. Especially on this point where like, you know, you need to try and, you know, make plays. You need to like try and just be as useful as possible, especially on this area. You don't want Widow to get set up like around the end of the point because then that's it. It's over. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh. Ah. <laughs> oh, that's huge. Nah, I'm on her. Kiriko over there. That's not. Oh, bro, she's killing everyone! <laughs> Just a Kiriko yeah. pocket. We don't make her. <laughs> ah, balls. That's fine. Oh, we got the mercy. Oh, that's huge. She didn't even try and get out. She just still kept trying to <laughs> She's like, this is it. This is my life now. Bah. Oh. You had, the, you had the idea, you were like looking away to make your like head hitbox better. Like usually I just look directly down and then just walk backwards at him, but that's like also going to oh, be yeah, way yeah. too hard to pull off, especially if you're not super consistent at warning. But like nice. I try to hide my head hitbox as like much as possible. Get a little practice of that. Yeah, pretty much like that. But I look directly down. You just like literally. I'm like, I'm like full on just trying to hide it as much as possible. I'm trying <laughs> yeah, to make yeah. my back like hide my head as much so, as possible. Just like a baboon presenting yourself. <laughs> so Farah, Farah, how do you deal with Farah as Lucio? 
Uh, that is just not worth your time. Like, yeah, you can poke her, but mercy healing is just gonna kick her up. You're better off just trying to, like, you know, mercy's gonna be focusing more on, like, helping uh, the far than anyone else. So, like, anyone else is more of a free kill. You can poke down the tank. Like, far mercy can be irritating because it's like if everyone's trying to look up at her and trying to deal with her, then it's an absolute nightmare if they can't get rid of her. So, it's in most cases, it's just, you know, might as well just go for their other DPS because they have one less healer, basically. It's like, mm -hmm. it's like having another, it's like having a Lucio that's just DPSing the entire game, except the Mercy's obviously actually doing something for a team while the Lucio is. <laughs> yeah. You, know. um, you can run at the farm, <laughs> but like, once you get a low, she's just gonna go, you know, straight away once a, oh my god. <laughs> Witness it again. So like, you don't try and like, yeah, you don't really don't frequently try and go at her in the air or whatever and try and well, hit her. I'm a content creator, right? I I will go for it because True. if I get her, then you know that's that's Twitter, that's YouTube, that's everything, you know. That's that's content. it. That's the video for the day. <laughs> it's true. People keep telling me to do the Li Zhang Tower rollout. They're like, "Osubi, you can do it." And I'm like, "Bruh, I played like five minutes of Lucio, and you want me to pull off like the hardest fucking shit in the game?" You just don't need to do it like every other way. Every other Lucio player does it. You just like the thing is that's perfect about Li Zhang Tower, and why I always say like, you know, learn that rollout first before you try to like learn any others, is because uh you can take like 40 different paths you know just choose your own adventure go whatever way you want whatever's more safe for you and more than likely you might find a faster route or one that works best or for like if the enemy team doesn't have speed you know the common problem is that you get to them too quick and they're still crossing bridge like they haven't even crossed the bridge yet mm. so it's like you know it's a waste and you just made yourself known and all that sort of stuff whereas you can take the other route that's a bit more safer going across the bridge and then jump over like the wall by the bridge and then right. that one's way more consistent do I do that one? No, because I like <laughs> I like the style points if I actually get a cool one off, so. Yeah, yeah. Um, Jungle Queen. Jungle Queen's my favorite tank to play with. Because I just run around with her 24-7. You just okay. shout when she, like if she shouts you speed. I, I assume she's shouting to engage, hopefully, but. Um, you gotta just kind of like, you know, this is, the, this is one other thing. You just gotta kind of like hope that your tank is, you know, knowing what they're doing and uh, Basically, whenever they look like they want to go in, that's when you speed. Okay. Like like now. Especially with Jungle Queen, you just want to like get her in there so she can get the axe swing as much as possible. I want to switch to Arisa. What do you do? Like Arisa's like kind of like Ryan Mini, Ryan Hart kind of type, right? Yeah, yeah. She's just a beefy tank. She won't really die. So you know, you can you can spend your time just marking their Reaper, getting them off the Arisa, because that's really the only threat to them dying. Their team okay. is pretty weak in terms of damage, I think. So like yeah, you can you can just spend your time marking their DPS, or you can just annoy their tank and then oh, just he kills everyone in the lobby. Yeah, I sensed <laughs> that he was gonna slam, but I was like, I don't know what else I can do about I this. Mean, I don't think you have all that quick, but then again, it's actually at fifty percent. So oh wait, yeah, actually he's done a lot. Never mind. Yeah, he's. Got I mean, they'll probably him. cycle through Nano Blade very soon as well. So no, they nanoed him at the end. So. Oh, they did? Oh, well, they'll yeah. probably cycle in Blade here, which more than likely... Um, I can beat, yeah. You just build beat, yeah, and then you won. Well, hopefully you win. Well, let's see how it goes. You should win this just because of Kiriko alone. That's what I'm... Oh, okay, let's go. Somehow my... Where was my hunter? though? Yeah, I'll say I'll say that beat was kind of like not needed, I would have yeah. probably beat it there out of just pure panic and not realizing like how many people were dead. But like they had like I mean three dead. It was like two people. They dead. they did. It wasn't even that like I didn't see how many people were dead. It was like I didn't trust the team to not all die to the vanilla. Blade. Yeah, no, hundred percent. I I totally agree with you on that. That's it's it's really true. Uh, but it's unfortunate your Honda wasn't in it. I think he's just landing again. Oh, almost. Keep him away. Yeah, you just keep him off your. Uh, oh, that's huge. That actually works out so well. Yeah, uh, I don't know. You can you can just constantly use boop to just not let any like their team is so close range, so you can literally just play to um just get it like the Reaper and the Reinhardt off your uh, tanks. Uh, you can go for boops here actually if you're lucky. You might as well. You know, you might as well just get silly farm, with it. Farm content. I don't know what this flank is that your team is doing, but you know, run with it. Nice, we just go for the Widow, that's huge. Don't even need to tell you what- Yeah! Don't even need to tell you what Oh, I get Lucio yeah, Gap? Lucio, Lucio Gap? Lucio Gap! Oh my god, the Lucio Gap! 
<laughs> Ew, they're running double sniper. That's gross. Yeah. I yeah. Love it. You know what? Just play more aggressive. I think you just play more aggressive. Like, you know, you tanks just being a little bit silly. You can just kind of just go for silly stuff. Like you can play with them at the start, and then like more or so over time. But you can kind of just yeah, just you know what? Just trying to kill the winner. Just see how it goes. Well, Zen. You win these. You don't win these. You walk away. Jesus, everyone's here. What the fuck? <laughs> Why did they not push? What the fuck? Yeah, bro. Giving you such terrible advice. Hey, right, her off. Yeah. Nice. This is your moment. A huge grab. Risk it. Risk it for the biscuit. Oh. Wait. Where is this? Where is this? <laughs> no, dude. Tanks don't move. Tanks don't move with the boob, dude. They literally, like, they, like, move half an inch. Look at this guy. He's, like, fucking dancing on the edge, and he still doesn't go anywhere. I don't believe it's 30%. I just simply don't believe it. They no, say it's 30%, but, like, no. I don't believe it. Oh, I can get this guy. Oh. <laughs> 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 oh, bro! Go! No go off the fucking map! That. What? You bitch! Oh, this tank message sucks. He should have died there. I think you own by like a little edge or a tank passive. I'm not sure. Yeah, just kind of poke out the wins in here for your charge as well. Just farm this man. Nice. I will say as well. I think like uh, you know, obviously you don't need your heal bot 24/7, right? But like uh, just shooting tanks is I think one of the most valuable things to do because you know that's probably why a lot of the high level Lucio players have like such high damage stats. Nice. Good boot, even though we kind of jumped on the point, I'll still take it. I mean, you need to stop point here because. Oh, you might be able to stop this. Oh man, but yeah, just go for it. Yeah, whatever, it doesn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry, I got you killed there. That's not me. No, no, no. I was like, I, I, I would have done the same thing. I was already like, let's just go, let's just go. It's like 92%. It's hard to pick and choose what you want to do there. I mean, you guys could have easily like soft reset, but I think everyone would have gone one by one because, you know, everyone's in their own little world that game. That game's just hard to play in because, you know, double sniper is. Especially pretty threatening. Surprisingly, they ran on cough, which is I never thought they'd succeed so well with it, but you know. They were just like, we're gonna gap him whenever he comes. They were like, we'll gap him on the brawl, we'll gap him on the double sniper too. Yeah, so like, do you feel like when it's like, okay, these, I don't know what this team is doing, I'm just gonna go YOLO on them in the back line? Yeah, yeah, I mean, like, you know, if you're having trouble, if people are just, like, if your teammate is being more of an enemy than you're, like, the enemy team, then, you know, why not? There's, there's not much of really of a loss. I mean, like, you're gonna lose the game because your team is teammates are being stuck. You might as well try and like make something cool happen. You know what I mean? It's like you know you get the you get the Twitter clip. Who gives a shit? You know? Exactly. Treat every game like you're going for a Twitter clip. <laughs> I mean, so so yeah, Hanzo. I've like I I, I I again, there's not a single character that I can, I've ever played. That I'm like, yeah, I want maybe the tanks, but like any DPS or support, I'm like, yeah, I'm losing to Hanzo. It doesn't matter where on the map I am, I'm losing to the Hanzo duel. But it's like any other characters that you're like. Do not duel this guy. Uh, Cassavi has nade. Um, anyone with a mercy pocket. Anyone who's actually getting healed. Uh, I think I think it's really just you know it's it's pure matchup like it's skill matchup most of the time with like a lot of characters you know. Sombra makes the game incredibly unfun. I always say like another game ruined by Sombra. You know like that character. Sorry. Um, but uh, all these balloons. Um, but anyways. <laughs> oh, you can't boot them. Boop is so weak, it doesn't even break the balloon. Sorry. Oh no, it does, okay. Oh! But uh, in most cases, yeah. Oh, Diva, this is great. Just farm ult charge off her, just keep shooting her. She okay. is so easy to hit, I just love fuck. What the fuck? <laughs> Bro, what the shit? <laughs> what the shit? That's so funny. <laughs> He's gonna go for me again, yeah, here he comes. Fucking what is this? What is this guy? Okay, uh, new plan. Don't worry about the diva. I think you just need to keep this Genji off you the entire yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. I just need you, to fight you gotta, this You got to try and fight back. You're just gonna go for it. It's personal now. It's personal now. Yeah. Plus, if I'm stopping him, I think that's the carry shut down. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's their that's their team carry easily. This guy's like smurfing. It's crazy. Oh, I beat this. Guys will be fine. Yeah, definitely. Ooh. I don't know oh. how she actually Rolled. managed to choke that so badly. I don't know how she managed to choke that so badly. 
<laughs> she's dead. Let's go. I my look. My problem with Lucio beating is that I'm way too. I hesitate way too much. It's either like, right. but at the same time, it's like you know, uh, it's it's better off to just like you might as well beat. Like you know, you might as well just go for it. And then if it's terrible, then you learn from it. You know. True. In a year's time, will you still learn from it? Yeah. Yeah, I reckon you just play back. You can. Nice. All right, so, um, yep, you... <laughs> well, that happened. It's just, just press, like, four Q buttons there. And for, some reason, for some reason, hacking you, like, that's necessary or something like that. <laughs> Damn. Christ. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I mean, look, that beat was fine. That beat was pretty much perfect. You didn't get the mail of it, but, um, she was out on that side. They used that oh. on the Ryan anyway, so... Yeah, 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 yeah. So you can definitely just go hard with a beat. I don't think the blade is gonna get that much value. Like you can, your cast has high noon, right? So you can just beat, speed the high noon. They'll like get forced back. You can run in and like group them into line of sight too if you want to. If you wanna get really creative. No. That's really unfortunate. That's really unfortunate that they had a lot of Q presses. Yeah. Yeah, no, your your beats are like great. The problem is is that unfortunately it's just they're pressing a lot of Q buttons and that's just they're straight up winning. Like they, they always win in overtime, so it's just except for first point, but like the past two fights, the past two times they've taken point, it's literally just been Q like presses and then you just lose. Which is like it doesn't matter, like you know, people say like beats you know, that crazy is that game changing. You just counter it by using more than one ultimate. You know? Yeah. Anything again, like significantly different you would have done there? I think it was pretty good. Like, you know, I'd war, I'd better. Uh, but... <laughs> True. <laughs> fair. Fair. <laughs> I, I'm sorry. Um, but no, no totally I think you're fair. playing 100% fine. Like, you're harassing the Sombra, you're not letting it play the game. Like, yeah, originally the whole plan was like, annoy the Genji, but like, then they went Sombra. You just kind of like, you know, annoy the Sombra. Don't let her get that much value. Like, yeah, she's not getting a kissness, like, consistent amount of value, but like, you know, the only reason why you're losing these fights is just Q presses. I think they might have some actually. Oh. oh, I wanted Xperico. I wanted that booty. Oh, yeah. I just wanted to I force Suzu unlucky. and get out. I mean, I mean, you're unlucky. You try to run into that room, but you jump off ahead. Oh, bro! <laughs> no way! No way! You actually just lost to like bouncing on Kiriko's head. I'm mean, oh, real. Like Lucio landing on a head there, she should just die. Like you know, you yeah. land on your head and skates, so just go. Oh shit! Cassidy's popping off. Yo, oh, this oh guy's sick. God. Do not let this man die. Oh my god. Yep, take his 4k, good. Don't let him get an ego, because then he'll start, like, playing too well. Gotta keep the ego in check, I respect it. Oh, they have Ryan now. Yeah, and you have, like, pretty much hard dive. Like, you can just jump past the Ryan, go past the Ryan, go for the back line, just be all good. Yo! Translate it away. You get out of there. Yeah, fuck. Yeah. It's another one. There's another one. Oh, wait, it's another one. Still another one. Yo. Nice. Let's go. Dive bomb. Oh, this is great. Yeah, you can just keep on pointing, and then you know you just free win. Don't let the mate touch. You know. Oh my god. Let's go. Nice, that's so good. That was such a good third point. Okay, Zarya, how do you approach Zarya? Uh, oh, I barely ever see Zarya, so it's been a long time since I've actually like worked with Zarya. I think it's just like... Uh... Worked with Zarya, you fucking professional Lucio player. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's what I am. I don't know, it's, uh, it's, just, it's, it's probably the same with like most tanks. Like, obviously, if she has no bubbles, you need to keep her alive, you need to speed her out, keep her away from danger. She's kind of only playing with Zarya to like counter the Arisa, I think. Like, so much Kira countering and lowering, it's so mild. I mean, you're just better off just uh, jumping in, probably like going for the Arna. You... But they also have Mercy, so oh, like, I suck. Yeah. You know. Yeah, I got a bit tunneled by Actually, the, the horny. I think mean, I mean, you're better off just trying to like farm beat and then winning off that. Okay, yeah. Because they do have a Mercy sense. pocket. Oh, big, big. oh, this is great, this is good. Yeah, just get in there now. Like, Mercy's dead, you can go for the Ash, you can go for the Arna. Start disrupting stuff. Good, good, yeah! 
Yeah. I think a lot of people. Uh, ooh. Oh. Ah! You don't need to get kills. Like as long as you're disrupting, being a distraction. Like take. Like you know. I mean, like the strongest Lucio playstyle can be like just straight up being a distraction in solo queue, where like you just go in, you boot people around, and then you just kind of like run away to the point where like you know you're unkillable, where it's actually like annoying, like it's mentally annoying, and it's annoying people. Like obviously, getting more kills is well worth it, right? But at the same time, you know, you knock someone out of position, your team sees that, right? People are just gonna go on them and kill them. You know, that's like the main goal that you want out of teammates in solo queue. Obviously, people won't like listen all the time. But like, you know, this comes in situations where like, uh, people are playing high ground, like, you know, first point Shapali when you're attacking, like people are playing high ground, you knock them off that little high ground, like everyone plays on there, like that's almost a fight winner. Uh, it goes to several maps, you know, like Numbani, if people are trying to dive high ground, yeah, with like Life Weaver coming out, for example, like, uh, Lucio, like, obviously I kind of joked around saying like, you know, like he's just going to directly counter Lucio because of the whole like flower and stuff and like the pool. But like you just boot him off the flower, like then the whole value is gone. Like I think mm. Lucio will just absolutely destroy him as a you know character, which is great. It's kind of exciting. Um, can't wait for a bunch of teams to set up these <laughs> plays on a flower and then just get booped off instantly. <laughs> and the zoom in on the on the Lucio making his way around, sneaky boom. Yeah. All right, drum roll, please, chat. Let's go. Oh, diamond one, just the one rank. I think I think what I found is that like when I was in like gold and plat, I like basically had to duel my way out of trouble because like all this the the logic didn't like fell out the window, right? Like you can boop ten people yeah. out of position and it doesn't matter. So you gotta just like duel people and win. And then the higher you go, the more you start looking for like it's kind of the similar with Sombra to be honest. Where it's like in in gold, there's no point hacking like a tactical ultimate. It literally doesn't matter. It'll throw anyways. But yeah, yeah, yeah. the it's higher just, you go, the more you can make those plays. Like, uh, the more smarter you are in lower ranks, the less value you get. I don't know, like, it's, it, like, you just be dumb and you play to have fun. You do dumb stuff, you just, you know, you're like, yeah, if I get, if I kill the Widow, like, in, in Silver, that's hilarious, that's funny. Because the Widow's gonna be like, you know, I can win this 1v1. Then, in lower ranks, like, it's, it's like, you know, you call it mental warfare. It's literally just, their team's gonna get tilted at the Widow because she keeps dying to a <laughs> you know. Uh, I've always been curious to like see how like lowering uh, Lucio goes, but I'm not gonna like be like, oh my god, unring to GM, you know. Uh, anyways, but um, I I was always like uh, really curious of like how Lucio gets treated in lower ranks. But everyone says like it's so funny to hear like yeah, everyone hates Lucio because yeah yeah I they're like they're like he's not enough healing. Just pick something that heals. <laughs> oh my god, what is, what is this? a speed run? Speed run death. What the fuck are you doing? Okay, we gotta get out How of did here. every game have a Sombra? What's going on? Alright, so you guys are still- right, We can end on this like... guy. We can kill this guy. Yeah. Maybe. You know what? Yo, I the soldier! Uh... Oh, like the jukes on him! Soldier, fight him, fight him, yeah. fight him, soldier, fight him. The soldier is just abandoning you, I think, by the way. Bruh, the soldier's a pussy. <laughs> he pussied out. <laughs> no! <laughs> no! <laughs> so close. Well, they're running Ram, right? Uh, mm -hmm. Ram kind of just destroys. Like you get out, you, you accidentally just miss position when he's in Nemesis form. You're dead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The punches. So, but in most punch. cases, you can kind of disrupt him, keep him off your team. Like it's really risky because you know you want to be like, like you want to boot him into your team for like free L charge, like free kill, all that sort of stuff. But at the same time, getting close to him, it's like you know you can just get like I think it's free tap for or something like that. Like someone else will be shooting at you, more than likely you just get free tap by him, and then it's really hard to dodge. Yeah, yeah, I think you guys just up in this point. There used two ults. It's probably lucky you didn't have beat there because I feel like you would have just instantly beat it as soon as you heard ram ult. Like you can, yeah, you can yeah. beat ram ult in this situation, but they use EMP ram. Like those are the two ults that you have to watch out for. You can just go into this fight, beat for free, like beat and gauge for free, and then guarantee you win it. You know, you you're probably 100. Wait, do you have like five ults? Oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. There's so much trying to be funny. I can beat now. We just go. Yeah, the only thing you need to worry about is getting hacked. But like, you know, you're good. Oh yeah, it's good. Yeah, Lucio, there, huge. Oh, the Ramat almost had me. Let's go, fellas. Let's go. Nice. I think it's also good there uh, when your soldier advisor just you know speed him around. Yeah. Just get yeah, with yeah. him and just try to help him out. I think it was like fighting someone already, so it doesn't really matter. And most of the people that were, like, I only say that because what the fuck? 
Huh? Hello. <laughs> okay. Oh, I want to push him off there, but. Yeah, yeah. Now remember this: you get you get stuck in the wall several times. Uh oh. You know what? You're out. You're fine. No issue. Nope, I'm not out. Oh, I'm no out. issue. It's fine. You're fine. You're fine. It's okay. <laughs> yes, aggro, aggro drawn. Nice. Okay, you can just watch your cast speed when you hit like you know high noons mm. and work off that. Hopefully, you get something out of it. Oh, we are so fucked. Giga they, fucked. I'm they out. They do the EMP Ramatra on again. <laughs> well, you got a free beat again. Like they just EMP and Ramatra all I like they just they're just throwing these fights by doing that. I can't believe it. Yeah, you just get a free beat as long as you didn't get hacked mid beat here, which I don't know where she is, which is hiding. I don't even need beat actually. Yeah. yeah, yeah, I think we got this one. Yeah, you just you just win last. Nah, that's a throw. That's a throw. Nice. You just win. Yeah, you could just go for. The... Yeah, you just annoy Anna. You can knock her off high ground. Just get her like, you know, in weird positions. I'm watching a team tonight. I think it might be like more value to just. Boop Sig into your Arissa so Arissa can get free uh, stuns yeah, on Yeah, fair. Yeah, I was like, let me disrupt this support, but yeah, maybe just... It's not even metal rank anymore, but like so much of like diamond as well. It's just like fight the tank with your tank. And if you don't pretend yeah, yeah, yeah. that, people just like... The game doesn't function. But also, yeah, you know, like, uh, they have Mercy Honor. Like, nothing's really, like, you know, lower, like... Most of the squishies aren't going to die because they're going to be able to keep each other up super well. Do you have speed in Kitsune? Um, yeah. Well, you have cooldown action. You might as well, like, as soon as, you know, the yeah, thing goes yeah. off, you just, I just do it every single time. Depending on what the team needs, you know, I just go for it. I just try to use as much cooldowns as possible. Nice. Yeah, just keep shooting him. You've lost your Arisa, but you can still turn this. You just farm this guy for all charge, and then, you know, you've gotten it. So you guys can just push cart until the Arisa gets back. You can taxi her if you want. Mm -hmm. I'd probably yeah, suggest I doing it. Yeah, I think it makes Might sense. as well. They're already back. And then you can just beat in this fine. Oh, they might have Sigurd actually, yeah. Yeah, there you go. Yeah! Wait, Sigurd dies. That's all you. What the fuck? What? Never mind. Where'd they go? <laughs> Where'd everybody go? Your tight team just, your tight team just sort of slammed to the low ground. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what your tank's gonna get up to. If you actually want to go high ground, but you can just speed him up high ground. Just go run to the sig. Oh, this is great. Oh, he's struggling. Bro, there's an open wall there. <laughs> the cat's going behind. Alright, nice. You win that. You win that match up now. No nade. Huge. Oh shit. You're fine. Oh, that's big. Yeah. Yeah, well, like Reinhardt versus Sig, for example. Like, you know, you can just speed your Ryan. He can just swing on the Sig. The Sig can't really, like, do as much because obviously no mobility. Can't really sail either well. And, you know, they also don't have cleanse. Um, but just get, you know, this guy's, like, critical, so you can't really get him in there. But, like, in most yeah. cases, you just would. Nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Sweet. Nice. Did we even lose? No, we lost uh, like maybe one game, yeah. Yeah, you lost uh, last game. No, not last game. Game before that. Mm. Nice. Yeah, I need like parting advice. Well, the, good, there's, the good thing is that you, you know, you, your game sense is like, you know, it transitions well. Like that's the thing that's great about Lucio is that like, if you have good game sense, it transitions perfectly. You can just, you know, you know what you're doing. You don't die that much, which is absolutely wonderful. Mm -hmm. Um. But, you know, I think obviously it doesn't like, you know, I think the only thing like uh, that's lacking is just the uh, wanting to like disrupt stuff more. Like, you know, it's good. Like like on Jungle Town, for example, you were on that SIG, you know, like you were annoying the living hell out of him, which is great. Mm -hmm. uh, but it's getting to the getting to the point where like, you know, you can constantly just be irritating towards Sigma, you know, Reinhardt. Um, most tanks, I think, actually. Yeah, like, uh, keeping a ball off your team, too. Like, you know, you kind of didn't really like, get every single tank matchup, like, that much. So it wasn't really, like, you know. But I think, I think the most important thing is just that, like, in lower ranks is not letting the enemy tank get that much value. Because if the tank crumbles in, like, you know, those ranks, then, you know, 
the entire team crumbles because they are they're all hoping that the tank will actually be able to do something. <laughs> yeah, that's um, very interesting. Because like I don't I, I haven't really focused too much on like trying to annoy the tank. I've been like I'm gonna go duel the flankers, but like yeah. Yeah, no, but the, the dueling flanker stuff is fine. I was very surprised that it actually works out really well because obviously in high ranks people actually know how to play against that sort of stuff. So mm -hmm. I was like, yeah, you know. Um, but no, yeah, you'll definitely see, like, I think you'll climb super quickly because Lucio is probably, like, one of the easiest supports to climb on. I'm sorry. I'm, don't uh, hate me for saying that. He's very easy to climb on. <laughs> oh, he's, like, busted. But, um, I, yeah, like, it really just comes down to game sense beating all that sort of stuff. Like, in most cases, beats were good. You know, the only thing is just, like, you know, even I need to work on it is uh, hesitating a beat. I'm just giving myself advice here more than anything. It's just like, you know, do I beat? Do I not beat? You might as well just use it. Because you build quick, beat quick. You might as well just go for it. Unless it's, like, life-threatening. Like, you know, the game's going to end if you don't beat this fight. All that sort of stuff. Yeah, I think the main thing you just got to work on is just getting better at war riding, you know? Mm. <laughs> yeah, totally fair. Which hopefully, hopefully should go well. Like, you just get better at it over time. Like, that's unfortunately the harsh truth. There's no super secret to it. Like, yeah, you can do Lucio Surf, all that sort of stuff. Which is great. Yeah. Uh, but the the harsh truth is like people will be like, oh, how do you get better Lucio warning? Like, how do you get better like, aiming Lucio? All that sort of stuff. It's like you just keep playing. You, that's it. That's all you do. It's unfortunate, but uh, yeah. Hashtag truth bomb. Exactly. That's Sorry. a nice little truth bomb. Nice <laughs> all right. Yeah, I appreciate you a lot, dude. Yeah, no, appreciate you a lot for giving me your time. Thanks a lot, dude. And uh, yeah, thanks oh, for the advice. And have a great rest of your day. Oh, you too. Take care. Peace out, man. Thanks for joining.